Hi guys, it is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous Tuesday morning. We have made it to Tuesday, March 19th, 2013 in the drought-plagued wasteland of South Austin, Texas. I am back on my rock for the first time in I think 10 or 11 days. The, the hippies have moved on, moved on out of my life, giving me my rock back. And you would think with this beautiful day and having my rock back, that maybe the old curmudge in the doom here wouldn't be in such a grumpy mood. But guys, you know, part of my job here is being the chronicler of the downfall of civilization. And I have discovered completely by accident that the newest threat to civilization at least the 18 to 30 year old uh, segment of probably global civilization that we are depending on, that us old, uh, us old farts who screwed this thing up so bad, uh, I'm just gonna give you an idea of who we are leaving this planet to to fix the mess. And it, 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 it's an ugly, sad state of affairs and I didn't get right to that. Okay, the newest threat to global civilization and just in case you're unaware of it and if you're over the age of 26 you probably are unaware of it is grumpy cat. Grumpy cat. It, it, it's some goddamn cat. A cat. Uh, that, that somehow has wormed his way into the, I, 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 I shudder to even use the word brains, consciousness, psyche, uh, any of these words uh, of, uh, of, these, uh, of these just completely deluded morons. This new internet sensation, Grumpy Cat. I was completely unaware of Grumpy Cat. Nowhere on Hambone Little Tail's radar until Sunday when I went on. I was simply trying to go on to get a damn weather forecast. On Sunday, you know, I was in the middle of the South by Southwest this big music festival going on in Austin, Texas uh, last week. So I go on the Weather Channel and whenever you go on the Weather Channel and, and I guess it's site specific to what city you're looking for, these little irritating little videos are going off on the side like some little cockroach you need to slap. That has nothing to do with the weather. So this little irritating video which somehow penetrated my own brain was about the, this, this big news of the, the most exciting news coming out of South by Southwest was Grumpy Cat was, was heading to Austin, Texas, I guess in a limousine. And I, I think I honestly believe that this video was coming from CNN News the mainstream media, what they choose to highlight out of, out of the South by Southwest Festival, which is not only music, but uh, it's film, it's high tech. Uh, I, I mean, good God, uh, they chose to view some goddamn cat coming to Austin. And uh, I, I just, uh, I couldn't resist going to, to research this. And good God almighty, guys. I, so I went on YouTube and I, and I plug in Grumpy Cat S by SW to see if I was making this thing up. Well, guys, uh, I, I'm just going to, I mean, I don't know how many videos on this damn cat just just at South by Southwest. Uh, here's 
just let me run through a half dozen of them. Here's the Grumpy Cat interview. So here's this guy interviewing Grumpy Cat, South by Southwest. Here's Grumpy Cat Madness. Grumpy Cat Madness at South by Southwest. And what this is a video of is, is this cat, this poor abused animal. No wonder the goddamn cat is grumpy. Here he is in, in a limousine. In a limousine with, with, with these clueless morons lined up with their smartphones to take a picture of some goddamn cat. Some woman holding up a cat in the back seat of a limousine. I I'm talking hundreds of people lined up to get a picture on their smartphones of a cat in a gas-sucking limousine. Let's see. Here's the next one titled The Line to See Grumpy Cat at South by South West. Here is the description of this video. Meeting Grumpy Cat was going to be the highlight of my virgin South by Southwest experience, but then I saw the line. And so uh, this woman, I guess as a woman, I don't know. I, I can't imagine anyone with testicles waiting in line for hours. So they, they go up and down this line and it stretched for blocks, guys. It wrapped around the block. People waiting, men and women, most of them, I would say the vast majority of this of this crowd, these young, beautiful, hip, 20-something beautiful people standing in line for hours. So they could have their uh, their five seconds of fame being photographed with some goddamn cat. And, uh, you know, and the cat doesn't lead. Grumpy is not so much the word. The cat looks like, it's suspiciously like, he's being doped up, which is what I think he is being. Uh, you know, he looks to me li like he, he's ODing on, on some sort of lobotomizing, uh, some sort of lobotomizing drug who he actually reminds me of is is my sister's cat uh the boogaloo soul king of 1968 who uh somehow took seven panes of window pane acid uh the cat uh dosed himself on seven tabs of acid and and looked a lot like grumpy cat till the day he died when he got run over in the middle of the when he went and, uh, and and laid down in the middle of the road and got run over. That was the uh, end of, of the Boogaloo Soul King of 1968. And and I feel I got nothing but pity for this cat. No wonder the goddamn cat is grumpy. He's being he's being flown all over the U.S. Uh, you know, being put on airplanes and then going from the airplanes uh, being put into limousines uh, carted around in cars. I don't know about your cat, but, but if you want to see a goddamn grumpy cat, come look at my cat. I ought to bring Max out here. And, and, and I could imagine, you, you want to see a damn grumpy cat? To take Max and, uh, and, and put Max in a goddamn limousine and then haul him off to some to the South by Southwest festival and 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 so he can be photographed with uh, you know hundreds if not thousands of these clueless morons uh, Max would turn around and, and, and take their damn faces off you know this cat is obviously doped up. 
You know, the goddamn cat simply wants to go home and be left alone. They're torturing this animal. The SPCA ought to be rescuing Grumpy Cat. Okay, where was I? So this was the line to see Grumpy Cat in South by Southwest. Okay, what's next here? We have Grumpy Cat hits South by Southwest in style. And uh, so this video, you know, you actually take a tour. You get to see Grumpy Cat's limousine. You get to see Grumpy Cat's four-star hotel room. Okay, you, you got to understand, guys, that, that we have musicians from, from all over the planet, not just musicians, independent documentary filmmakers, you know, scraping up all their money that they can get to come down here to uh, to South Austin, Texas, so they can so so that they can show their their musical act or their uh, or, or their doc their indie documentary filmmaker to about ten or twelve people, about ten or twelve people coming in to to see uh, what they, to see their art or whatever. And while you have this going on, and, 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 these, and these guys who can't scrape enough money together, uh, the, you know, this is why we have all of these young hippies living in these tents on the ground here in, in Jemmo's backyard, 100 feet from this rock, while we have this goddamn cat, uh, you, you know, hanging out in a four-star hotel room and Austin, do you know how damn hard it was to find a uh, to find a hotel room in Austin, Texas, the past couple of weeks, while while this goddamn cat has a has a hotel room in the limousine? Uh, can you imagine the fossil fuels that are being burned uh, for this cat? And and who's bankrolling this cat? And, and make no mistake about it, is this Frisky's cat food it is bankrolling. Uh, grumpy cat, a Frisky's cat food. Don't get me going on. I, I, I just uh, don't even want to think. Don't even want to think uh, about the amount of well, shall we say, overfished. Uh, you, you know how many uh, of these overfished ocean creatures. Are going in there. I'm sure they're the, the major ingredient of Frisky's cat food is Monsanto GMO corn. You, you know, we got people starving all over this planet. Millions of people going to bed hungry tonight uh, who would absolutely love to throw Grumpy Cat in the stew pot. Let's send Grumpy Cat over there to, let's send Grumpy Cat over there to Ethiopia and uh, see how many limousine rides and four-star hotel rooms Grumpy Cat gets met with in, in Ethiopia. The little son of a bitch you know, would be put out of his misery in the stew pot and, and might feed four or five people tonight. You know? Put the goddamn cat out of his misery in an Ethiopian stew pot so he could be doing some good for this planet. You know, I'm, I'm not blaming the cat, guys. The, 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 this poor, abused animal wants nothing to do with this shit. Nothing. Anyway, where was I? Grumpy Cat hit South by Southwest in style. Okay, here, latest news. This is from a, a YouTube channel called Today News World. Latest news. South by Southwest crowds flock to see Grumpy Cat. That's Today News World. Here's one from the Clever News. The, that's with two V's. Ain't that clever? Ain't a misspelling. Ain't abusing the uh, 
the king's language clever news this one is titled Ian Summerhalder's new love at South by Southwest I have no clue zero clue who Ian Summerhalder is I don't know I don't care I don't want to find out how this no doubt the, this 20 something brainless beautiful person Ian Summerhalder is but Ian whoever the hell he is has a new love at South by Southwest take a wild guess who Ian Summerhalder's new love is. Okay, so I, you know, I finally said, okay, who the hell is this thing? So I go on uh, the official Grumpy Cat YouTube channel. And the actual name of this channel, and I can't make this shit up, guys, the name of, of Grumpy Cat's official channel is Severe Avoidance. I cannot make this shit up. The, the Grumpy Cat's, assumedly Grumpy Cat's owner, who is probably a millionaire, uh, there's, you, know, you can get the t-shirts and the coffee cups and everything else, probably a millionaire by now, severe avoidance. And severe avoidance has 94,673 subscribers and 15 million, 15 million, 586,000 videos. I guess there's 19 videos. Official Grumpy Cat videos. 19 videos adding up to 15 and a half million hits and half of those hits come from one video simply called The Original Grumpy Cat. So this was the original video I don't know the date that it was published but this one video is responsible for right about one half so it has seven million six hundred and ninety thousand videos what this video is and uh, I, I'm not I, I'm not gonna waste my time by putting any of these video links Anyone who, who really gives a shit, and I do encourage you to go on these videos uh, to, to put the thumbs down on all of them. It, it is your duty as, as an awakened soul to go on at least this one video and, and put a thumbs down. Uh, so what this is is a video uh, of this cat lying there and, and somebody tickling Grumpy Cat, you see a human hand tickling Grumpy Cat. 7,690,000 views. We have 40,000 thumbs up and 677, make that 678 thumbs down to Grumpy Cat. Oh, Jesus Christ, guys. Y you know, y you might as well laugh about this. If, y y y you know, the world, the, the, this global civilization, and, and this species, and this planet, are, are, are burning. How many species of wild cat are we sending into oblivion while hundreds of clueless, moron, 20-something beautiful people are standing there 
in line for hours with their smart phones to take a picture of themselves next to uh, the mascot uh, of a cat food company. You know? I, I, I wish I could trade places with them. I really do. Uh, laugh, laugh all the way to the brick wall that, that we're heading into, guys. Uh, we're out of here. And uh, we deserve every damn thing. Anybody who is going to stand in line for hours to take a picture of a goddamn cat uh, who probably looks a hell of a lot like their own goddamn songbird killing cat in their own living room. You know, when the, when the great cleansing begins, may it begin with anybody who has thumbed up Grumpy Cat on the YouTube channel called Severe Avoidance. And enough about Grumpy Cat. This all grumpy chronicler of the downfall of civilization is going to get up off his rock and uh, I think I'm supposed to go be putting in some organic garden today. But I don't know, guys. I don't know. It's a crazy world. Smoke them if you got them. We're out of here. Bye, guys.